Hey, Rob here for Quadratech.com. Today we're checking out the Yakima Spare Ride Spare Tire Mounted Bike Rack, available to fit most vehicles with a rear mounted spare tire. Now that means it is going to be compatible with 2018 and older Jeep Wrangler JKs, TJs, and YJs. It's also going to be compatible with some other Jeep vehicles like some Jeep Cherokees if you've installed a rear swing out mount spare tire. Now, unfortunately, it is not compatible with the 2018 and newer Jeep Wrangler JL, as this spare tire mounted bike rack does mount through the center of the spare tire, which, as we know, is where Jeep has placed the rear backup camera. Now, with the spare ride bike mount, you will get not only the bike rack with folding arms, you're also going to get a locking bike cable. You're going to get six of the zip strips, which will secure your bike in the cradles on the bike rack. You're also going to get the mounting bracket along with three different length mounting tongues that will accommodate most tires that you'll find on a Jeep Wrangler. You're also going to get the locking handle with a pre-installed SKS lock core. You're also going to find a matching SKS lock core installed in the locking cable. Now those are interchangeable with other Yakima SKS lock cores if you've got some other Yakima products on your Jeep vehicle already. You're also going to find a pair of matching keys for those lock cores a locking tab, as well as an Allen key so that you can swap out those different length mounting tongues. Now, speaking of those tongues, the shortest tongue will come pre-installed on the mounting plate, and that is meant for a 195 to 235 width tire. Now, that's going to be smaller than a tire that you're going to find on the back of a Wrangler. So we will need to swap that out before we can get this installed with at least our medium length tongue, which is designed to work with a 235 to a 275 width tire, and that makes it perfect for a factory size spare tire on the back of a Wrangler. Now the longest tongue that is included is perfect for mounting with a 285 all the way up to a 12 and a half inch wide tire, which means this bike rack should work with most oversized tires that you'll find on your Wrangler. Now to get this installed, we need to go ahead and start by swapping out that short length mounting tongue with the medium length using the included Allen key. We'll also go ahead and remove the plate on the mounting bracket. Once we have that completed, we can go ahead and remove the spare tire from the tailgate of our Wrangler, slip the mounting plate over top of the lug studs, then pop out the center cap of our spare tire and reinstall it over top of the mounting plate back onto the tire mounting bracket. Now, once we have our spare tire resecured with the lug nuts, we can go ahead and slip the Yakima Spare Ride bike rack over top of the mounting tongue and then install the washer onto the mounting handle followed by the locking tab and then thread the locking handle through the Spare Ride bike rack into the mounting tongue until it's secure. Once it's tight, you can go ahead and lock it down with the included key. So as you can see, once you lock the handle, it actually free spins preventing anyone from being able to steal your Yakima spare ride from the back of your Wrangler. As an added benefit, when the bike rack's installed, it also acts as an anti-theft device for your spare tire, because to remove your spare, you first need to remove the spare ride. Now, it is designed to be mounted permanently on the back of your Wrangler, so that it's always ready to carry your bikes on your next adventure. However, it's still easily and simply removable when you do need access to your spare tire. Some of the great features found on the spare ride, as you can see, it folds the mounting arms down very neatly when they're not in use. When it's time to bring a bike along, simply lift the handle, raise the arms into place, and the lock in the upright position. You're ready to load your bikes onto the rack. Loading your bikes is simple. Simply place them into the cradle on top of the mounting arms that are padded and cushioned to protect your bike. The Yakima spare ride is designed to carry two bikes and it utilizes not only just the two mounting cradles on top of the arms, but it also features a third cradle that you can see swings down and then locks to your bike's down tube. Now you can lock your bike into place with these zip strips that simply click into place on each of the cradles. And once you lock that third cradle to your bike, that's an anti-sway cradle that helps prevent your bike from swinging back and forth. It's especially helpful if you've got two bikes on the rack. It's going to prevent them from crashing into each other when you're headed down the road. 
The Yakima does also include that locking cable that you can thread through your bike's frame and wheels and then through the locking tab on the spare ride to prevent theft of your bikes while they're left on your Wrangler. Now one other really nice feature that Yakima goes as far as to include is not one, but two bottle openers on the mounting arms up here, one for you and one for a friend for those great post-ride refreshments. Now, if you guys want to get any more information or purchase the Yakima spare ride, spare tire mounted bike rack for your Jeep vehicle with a rear mounted spare tire, you can click that info button to head over to quadratech.com. Of course, if you have any comments or questions about the spare ride, you can leave those for us in the comment section below or contact us directly at any of the options on the screen in front of you. And as always, you'll wanna make sure you hit that subscribe button so you're sure to catch all of our latest product reviews. Till next time, I'm Rob. See you guys out on the trail.